We're still talking about that controversy and U.S. President Joe Biden has encouraged voters to make their voices hard ahead of the midterm elections as he referred to the Roe v. Wade reversal as a, a tragic era and a sad day which will deny women the right to abortion in 22 states. Today is a, uh, it's not hyperbole to suggest, a very solemn moment. Today, the Supreme Court of the United States expressly took away a constitutional right from the American people that it had already recognized. They didn't limit it. They simply took it away. That's never been done to a right so important to so many Americans. But they did it. It's a sad day for the court and for the country. The president said that the U.S. Justice Department would defend any woman who travels to a different state to have an abortion. He added that the government will make sure that abortion medications are provided to anyone in need. Speaking in Illinois about maternal health, U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris recast her focus on the new ruling and decried the Supreme Court's decision. Why is it important? She emphasized on how the ruling would affect decisions on the right to start a family and on the right to use contraception. She also told citizens to raise their voice and have the final call by electing the right leader who will protect their rights. In defense of one of the most fundamental ideals and principles that for generations, for centuries, I believe, we had held dear, which is that fundamental principle about the importance of liberty. To stand for liberty, to stand for freedom, to stand for self-determination, and for the right to privacy. You have the power to elect leaders who will defend and protect your rights. And as the President said earlier today, with your vote, you can act. And you have the final word. So this is not over. Meanwhile, seven states, including Kentucky, Louisiana, Oklahoma, and Missouri, have already banned abortion. Texas and Tennessee have set a period of 30 days between the release of the judgment and a new ban coming into force. While Texas has even declared June 24th as a holiday. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.